Welcome to Animal A Day. 30 Facts, 30 Animals, Volume 9. The earwig name comes from the misconception that they like to burrow in people's ears and lay eggs, which can then hatch, travel to your brain, and cause havoc or death. This doesn't actually happen, though they could theoretically sleep in your ear for a night if you're unlucky, but the chances of this are slim, and other than sleeping they wouldn't do much. It might not look like it, but one of the craziest thing about hyraxes is the fact that they are one of the closest living relatives of the massive elephant. The two are in the same clade, along with dugongs and manatees. Pomeranians have the largest variety of American Kennel Club approved colors, combinations, and patterns in the organization. Their coats are thick and double layered and can come in a spectrum of colors including white, black, brown, red, orange, tan, cream, and many colors in between. When a prairie dog comes back to its community from an expedition, another member will greet it at their burrow's entrance. They perform a very cute looking face nuzzle that almost looks like they're kissing. They do this to verify the incoming prairie dog belongs to that family. If it doesn't, it will be attacked or chased away. Development of the Ukrainian Lovkoi cat began in 2004 in Ukraine when a breeder wanted to make a hairless cat with folded ears. A male Scottish fold was mixed with a hairless Donskoi. As you might have guessed, the Scottish fold provided the foldy ears. Umbrella birds have long cylindrical tubes hanging from their necks that males inflate to help them make deep, booming mating calls. Upside down catfish swim faster while upside down. It causes them to use more energy, but it's actually a more efficient way of gathering food from the top of the water. Euromastix lizards are known for their very spiky, weapon looking tails. Each lizard has 10 to 30 rings of sharp protrusions or spikes used to defend themselves. Their tails are also used to shield the entrance of their sleeping burrows to prevent an attack on them while sleeping. Utonigans are used in shows and movies to depict wolves because of their close appearance to them. In Game of Thrones, the dire wolves of the Starks were portrayed by them. Vaquitas are considered the marine mammal that is most critically endangered, with less than 10 individuals thought to be alive as of last year. Illegal fisheries in their home range use giant gill nets to catch the highly valuable totalba fish, among other things. Vaquitas have a high chance of becoming their unfortunate collateral damage. Once a prey is caught, the vermilion flycatcher will thrash its victim into submission before consuming them entirely. This both kills it and softens the insect's body so it can be digested more easily. Pecunias, along with guanacos, are the only two wild species in the llama genus. Alpacas and llamas proper are both considered domesticated, with the vast majority of their numbers in captivity, whereas vicuñas and guanacos are considered wild animals for the opposite reason. Despite their name, vine snakes don't just climb vines. They are also known to move through branches, leaves, and grass, using their prehensile tails for support. Vizlas are ride-or-die companions, usually not wanting a single minute away from their favorite human. This level of loyalty is rare, even amongst other dogs, and has given them the nickname of Velcro Dog. Volcano snails have magnetic iron scales called sclerites, so they can be picked up with a magnet. It's not totally known why they have these, but they may be some form of protection. It is the only organism in existence we know of that incorporates iron in its body this way. Voles are thought to have an advanced level of empathy not normally found in creatures of their intellect. If one vole was harmed in any way, others can sense this and will groom the abused rodent more than they would have otherwise. Wallabies have escaped from zoos and founded their own wild populations outside of their home countries at least twice. The first time it happened was in Hawaii in the early 20th century, and the second time was in France in the late 20th century. They're still thriving to this day. 
Walruses are actually a type of seal, and are the third pillar in the true seal group, alongside eared seals and earless seals. They can avoid losing oxygen while submerged by storing it in their muscles and bloodstream during dives. As a result, they possess a significantly greater amount of blood than a land-dwelling mammal of comparable size, typically double or triple. The diving bell spider has evolved to live entirely underwater, using specialized air pockets to breathe while submerged. It creates an underwater bubble to live in while it feeds on aquatic insects. Female waddled jacanas essentially form reverse harems. This means they mate with up to four males, with each male only mating with her. She will go around her territory and protect the nest somewhat, but once the eggs hatch, the fathers exclusively care for the hatchlings. Weimaraners were used extensively to hunt big game like bears, wolves, boars, and cougars, among other things. German royalty were so proud of their Weimaraners for this that they kept their existence a secret for a long time. Western blind snakes have thick, unique-looking hexagonal scales that overlap with each other. Since they live most of their lives in the darkness of the depths of the earth, they don't really need true eyes. They do, however, have two simple eyes that can only detect the presence or absence of light. These features are not very common among snakes. Wolverines are infamous for being vicious attackers that use sharp claws, sharp teeth, and a very strong bite force to take down much bigger prey. They're called gluttons by some because once they take down a big prey, they'll dig into the corpse with no manners or grace, instead chowing down on it like it's an all-you-can-eat buffet with a time limit. Shingu river rays eat three times a day on fisher and vertebrates. They can actually eat things that are harder than their jaws, like snails and crabs. This type of feeding is called neurophagy. Sholo eats quintiles, were one of the first dogs registered with the American Kennel Club way back in 1887. In 1959, the breed was expelled due to its extreme rarity at the time, which led to rumors of its extinction. After years of campaigning and re-establishing the breed by certain groups, they were finally allowed to re-enter the American Kennel Club's breed registry towards the end of 2010. Yaks are so well adapted to the cold that warmer temperatures are dangerous to them. They can develop heat exhaustion if subjected to temperatures around 60 degrees Fahrenheit or 15 degrees Celsius or higher. Yellow crazy ants are fairly unique for ants in that one colony can have literally hundreds of queens. Workers from other queens generally don't fight or conflict with each other, so multiple colonies can work together, which leads to the development of massive super colonies. Yellow spotted lizards became well known after the release of the book and eventual movie, Holes. They were depicted as being extremely aggressive and causing a very painful and guaranteed death. This is not really true for a number of reasons though, and the movie actually used a completely different lizard to depict them. Zebra finches are used as a model organism. This is an animal that is thoroughly researched to comprehend specific biological mechanisms, with the hope that findings made in it will offer understanding on how other similar organisms work. They were only the second bird to get its genome sequenced behind the chicken. Zocors are highly adapted for digging as they have curved, extended front claws that possess great strength and feet that are sizable and sturdy. Their claws naturally sharpen themselves with use. They use their shovel-like hands to move dirt under themselves and use their feet to kick it behind them. Most other members of the mole rat family use their incisors to dig, making Zocors fairly unique. Thanks for watching. Now take that subscribe button to the zoo.